up in this place. Are you all right? The baths are closed. Leave me be. On second thought, perhaps you are just what I need. Might your services be for hire? That depends on the job. I'd have you save my business, the baths. The water's turned scalding hot and all the crystals in Dalimil wouldn't be enough to cool it. I've no doubt that my woes stem from the water's source. But I can't go and investigate for fear of my customers thinking I've abandoned the place. I'm bound to these baths in more ways than one. I beg of you. Go to Dusnoff Terraces. Tell me what you find there. All right. I'll go and take a look. Wonderful. It's not far. Leave the market by the south gate. The smell of sulfur will guide you the rest of the way. These baths are all that keep me from an ignoble end in a debtor's prison. My livelihood, my very life, is at stake. I... Hmm. I mean, I get it's for his livelihood, but my main question is, how come is it he's I not allowed to Jones ever speak. leave the bats? Like, they think he abandons it? It's like he owns the fucking place. We it doesn't get need to be open 24-7, does it? It's a bath. <laughs> well, then again, a nice shower and a nice bath always does feel good. Come on, go. Here's the fork in the head. Oh, well, that would definitely do it. Huh, and there's some blacked out ones out there, too. Well, now we know what to expect. Hello. Free potion. Nice. Something awful's taken up residence in the springs. You'll turn back if you know what's good for you. <laughs> I'm afraid. Bring it the fuck on. By the flames. That explains the heat. Shoots much bigger shit. Now you bitch. I was not expecting a purple one. Let's cool things down a bit. Let's hope it's enough to keep the baths from boiling. Now just had that. Ooh, treasure. Uh, open. Just what happens. <laughs> X is also the. 
I was hoping we'd be seeing you again. The baths grow more bearable by the moment. It won't be long now before we are back to business as usual. I'm glad to hear it. Now, tell me this. What did you find at the terraces? What threatened to make me a pauper? Not what I expected, that's for certain. You tell a fine story. That's not to say I don't believe you, though. Creatures made of flame, eh? That's something new to worry about. But I burdened you with my worries enough already. Here, a small something by way of thanks. Right, it's high time I got back to work. With a little luck, the day might yet be salvaged. Scarlet Hmm. Alright. Right. Wait. Thanks, What's Carl. going on over here? So that's blocked. I can't go that way then. I'm not sure what's over there, but I am curious. Hmm. <coughs> he said for me to go in by the mines, since there are less people there. Side. Along with goodness knows how many guards, all on highest alert, you'll need to keep your wits about you if you're to reach him. So be careful. I will, Uncle. Before you go, Clive, allow me to apologize. After what befell at Phoenix Gate, and the crisis that followed in its wake, I fled. I retreated to my counting house and danced attendance upon the Vicerine in the hope it would bring me favor. I betrayed my nation to save my skin, like the coward I am. And I'm sorry. Uncle, please. It's not too late, Clive. Rosaria is yours by right, and there are those that would help you to take it back. Had I the courage of my brother, I might already have done so. But that ship has sailed. You, however... No. Forgive me, but I cannot. I fight to build a new world now. A better world. Where men can live and die on their own terms. I was raised in a nation that strove to improve the plight of bearers. Later did I realize that spark of freedom did not arise by chance, but was kindled by my father. You would see me follow in his footsteps. And that is exactly what I mean to do. Not by ruling Rosaria, but by extending his ideals to the whole of the twins. Though every soul in the realm may judge my actions heresy, 
I am certain my cause is just. You really are just like him, you know? Thank you, Clive, for coming back to me. I am proud to call you nephew. Well then, this is where we must part ways. Wish me luck in convincing my Canvarian friend to share his considerable talents. I mean to plunder his coffers and prove myself worthy of a place in your merry band. <laughs> Till then, my boy. Till then. Go safely, uncle. And you, nephew. We have much to catch up on, you and I. I should expect you to regale me with the tales of all your adventures when next we meet. <laughs> you can regale me too, Torval. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming for you, Kuka. To be honest, we didn't really get to explore much of the jaw. I kind of want to go there and explore, but I'm also curious if there's anything new at the hideout. Let's see. Desert Alliance. I trust you will forgive me for putting you and your dear uncle to the test. I am confident that a man of your precision can understand the importance importance of <laughs> carrying one's trust, mm -hmm. especially in times like these. For what it's worth, you now have earned mine, and I can assure you I shall not easily relinquish. May this be the start of a fruitful relationship? How is that a quest? It's not a quest. It said there was like a quest here, or like a mission, but where? <laughs> hmm. Oh, it's across there. Okay, so it's not in my studies. I thought it was in my studies, but it's not. I figured I should come back here and see what's new, and <clears throat> I'm glad I did. It says something about a new quest popped up. The little ones have been up to their old tricks again. What, a new monster to hunt, too? killed it. <laughs> He's already dead, bud. Before you even can tell me that, I already took care of him. Hmm. Yeah, this place is dead. What is this part of that Thank building? Thank for coming back to us. You're the glue keeping this place together. You're welcome. I think I'll wait till mid some way to take a tour to the dungeon. I want to get roped into the next spot. Hmm. So. Well, it said there's a new quest, but I already did that. I killed that turtle a long time ago. Thanks for 
let me do this, Clive. I'll pay you back, I promise. Um... Well, okay. The only other person I could talk to that might know if there's an extra quest I need to do or something is going to be the guy at the front desk, so I better go talk to him first. It looks like he has nothing new on his head, but let's see what's going on in the realms. Fancy a look at the list, do you? Anything catch your eye? Nope, we did all the quests Always for something all areas. Alright, well... Oh wait, she has something to say? Alright. It's not in the library. Alright, there's nothing out in the fields. Okay. Well, you're the last person that has anything to say, so by all means, tell me. Here for another of my lectures. What is it that you wish to learn? Study it well, Clyde. From what I'm gathering, is that most of their forces are going to be focused on this, and then there's, I don't know why, but the Empire has some of their people here too. Or was it the, hold on. I have the details here. We made sure of that. She's currently with the Empire. It wasn't him. Who was it that I saw that carried him off? Warden of Darkness at the Battle of Took personal command of the Royal Army, but rode into the fray himself, galloping through the air atop his six-legged steed. see anything else on here but here's the latest information I have there's gotta be something about the guy who
key in that. Yeah, that's the guy I killed. But I don't know if there's any damage in his position. So I was right, it is the dominant Odin that took him in, right? The state of the realm is ever changing, Clive. I know. That's why I came to look to you about what the hell we're doing with this, but I'm trying to think what could Odin want with Titan on his side. I mean I get that they're afraid that going to war with Titan well Titan doesn't even care about his home country, so he only cares about getting revenge on me. So if they have Titan, then they have no reason to hold back and just take over the entire south-like area, right? They would have nothing to stop them. Especially if they have Titan on their side. 